yeah, Microsoft. So I think we've talked about this. Uh, we've talked about this. And let me just get there. All right. We've talked about this uh, in the past. Kind of the the uh, Linda Kahn's, you know, just campaign against a big tech and the idea of breaking them up and the idea of you using uh, antitrust against them. Lena, not Linda, Lena Kahn uh, at the FTC. And uh, one of the one of the things that Lena Kahn has done is, is she sued um, Microsoft to try to stop the merger with uh, what is it? Uh, what's it called? Activision Blizzard, which is the big gaming company that actually has, um, what is it, on call, uh, duty on duty, I can, I, as a non-gamer, I don't even know what the game is called. Um, but uh, Activision, uh, you know, owns this uh, Call of Duty, sorry, Call of Duty and World of Warcraft, which are uh, th these two massive games that have made Activision this massive, uh, incredible company. Uh, anyway, it, 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 FTC sued in court, and uh, a district judge uh, court in San Francisco ruled against the FTC. How cool is that? And uh, basically uh, approved that the deal could go uh, on. The deal will close here soon unless uh, the government appeals it and, and uh, there is an injunction uh, at, the, um, at, the higher, uh, at the higher level. But uh, it does look like this will go through. The FTC is considering its options uh, right now. Anytime we can defeat Lena Khan, that is a plus. Anytime the FTC is defeated, that is a plus. Anytime antitrust take a beating, that is a plus. So this is great news. Um, and I know some of you hate Microsoft, but I don't. And, and this is great news. Uh, the deal was a, a teetering also because, uh, and I made a mistake the other day when I said that it was... Um, that it was European Union that was blocking the deal, but it, it wasn't. It was actually the British English courts, the English regulatory agency was blocking the deal. But yesterday, when the court came out with his opinion, the English regulators basically said, okay, we will reevaluate. Uh, Microsoft withdrew from its suit, suing the regulatory agency, and is now negotiating with the British regulators to get the deal approved. So it looks like the deal would go through in the UK, in Europe, in the United States, and Microsoft will be able to buy this company. Whether that's good for gaming markets or not, I don't know. Uh, one of the issues was the fear that Call of Duty would be only, Microsoft would only allow it to be played on Microsoft products, right? On, on, on the Microsoft gaming platform. Um, Microsoft said it's got long-term contracts with both Nintendo and Sony, and, and it's ridiculous. It, 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 it makes so much money from this uh, through Activision. That why would it do that? Um, and, uh, and the court seems to believe Microsoft It basically said FTC provided no evidence that uh, Microsoft intended to, quote, supposedly monopolize this game on its own platform. Um, so we will see. It doesn't really matter. From my perspective, they can monopolize it. It's their product. They can decide who gets it, who doesn't get it. They can decide on the terms. Um, so, again, good news. Anytime the FTC is, uh, is, is defeated, that is good news.